Parables are those stories that Jesus tells that teach us about the Father himself. Now today's, from Matthew, the Gospel according to St. Matthew, is the net, right? Jesus says the last days, the last day will be like a net cast out into the sea and all, because it's not like, that's not how like Peter, James, and John fish, right? They didn't have like the hat on with all the stuff on it. And they're like, press me a worm there, will you? And he goes, you know, that's not how they fish. They would throw these big nets out and drag all the fish in. And sometimes all the fish would be good. Some of the fish wouldn't be. It's kind of like that scene from Forrest Gump, right? Where they built the net at first and there's like 10 cans in there and stuff. Oh, well, you know, Lieutenant Diane, there's not enough shrimp type thing, you know? I don't know if any of the angels talk like Forrest Gump. That'd be pretty fun, though. But you have this last, so they bring in all the fish, and then it says they're separated. And this is like the last day. The angels will separate the good from the bad on the last day. Not today, but on the last day this will happen. Everybody will be dragged in, and the separation happens. But we try to do that today, don't we? That's why Jesus says this is the last day this happens, not today. So it's not our job to go out and try to say, okay, good, bad, good, bad. You may be good today. You may be bad for a week. He may be bad for a month and then great for a decade. We don't know. It's not our job to do that. Our vocation is to pray, praise, and give thanks. Our vocation is to honor, obey, serve, love, and cherish. Our vocation is to pray and let God take care of everything. Our vocation is to receive, to thank God that we are a good fish, that on the last day is, whoo, into paradise. That's who we are. Our vocation is to continue to be in the water, that we may remain in Christ, to be alive in Christ, to die to the world, to die to sin, and to live in Christ. Our vocation is not the angel's vocation to do this mass separation. Let us pray that more are converted. Let us pray that we all have penitent hearts. Let us pray that the Holy Spirit gives us a righteous despair. And let us pray that we all abide in humble faith that relies completely on the mercy of Christ. We're not saved by what we do, but by what Christ did for us on the cross, what he finished on the cross, and the benefits we receive in the means of grace. Let us take heart in that. The last day will come. It's not for us to do this work. It's for us to rejoice in the conversion of everyone, including our own. God bless y'all. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Did we do good? Is that, is that okay? If, if you liked that, hit the button that says that you like that. Maybe even subscribe to see more of these. Even give. Help us fund this mission of making known the gifts of Christ Jesus to youth and young adults. If you like this video, check out our website, higherthings.org, and check out more content from Higher Things.